Rob, I, people think he's flawless. He's not flawless. His neutral air can get linear. That's the thing. It can get linear. Up air, if you time that right, you can keep him in the air. Offline, it's a lot easier to parry it. Cloud has crazy out of shield and that yeah. uppy and climb hazard. I certainly agree with you, my friend. He's got the tools to beat Rob. Question is, can he avoid uh, the jank? You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, one of the crucial things is that Cloud is really good at an advantage here. And one of the biggest tools that Rob has is Nair. And Cloud can literally just up B through it. Um, you can obviously, a lot of characters have to parry it to punish it. Cloud doesn't. You can also just up B out of shield. And juggling Rob, very good. I mean, you know. It's important. I don't, I don't want to say, you know, too much about Rob's, uh, you know, body, but he is big boned. <laughs> that's to say the least, man. Big metal bones. You're dead. Oh, no, actually yeah. going for the forward smash there. I thought that was going to be a side B. It's looking like Dill. Oh, wow. Not wanting to stale it, probably. Probably wants yeah. to save that for a little bit later, keeping that out. And yeah. yeah, you know, Cloud is like no stranger to keeping opponents at disadvantage, and that is a huge, huge thing if you're going to play against a Robert the Robot. You got characters with insane up airs. You got your Marios. You got your Clouds. You got your uh, potentially even Yoshis, though. That matchup was a little different. You, if you can keep Rob in the air, man, I can't describe how important that is and how important it is to play on point and not mess up your advantage state against this character. Cloud is the kind of character that can do that because of that up air. Except when you're dead, because yeah. you don't have a jump. And, and you know, baby uh, baby Cola over here playing Cloud and Roy. I was about to say, like, what is it with, like, the, what is it with Raw players oh. and also having Clouds? Yeah, I mean... I mean, Roy, my bad. The, one of the things is that, you know, you can't really play the game until Gyro's accounted for. It's, it's like Diddy holding banana or like a lot of characters that have like a projectile for neutral. You can play the game with Rob normally for a mo momentarily if you wait until that gyro is, is accounted for. Right now he has gyro, it's going to be really hard for you to deal with it. And that's kind of how you have to start this this match. I mean, we're seeing Carflow like not really be able to get in on, on Dill. And Taking the stock right there with the roll in cross slash. That was clutch. He really needed that. If, if he whiffed that, that would have been pretty bad. Oh, it doesn't matter. The back Lord. air going to do it. It lingers. That move my needs friends. to be nerfed. Lingers around for Impossible a very long time. Impossible to a whiff. Giant, beefy, strong hitbox that you can whiff and you'll still hit. Yeah. And I mean, I'm, I'm not sure if I. Uh... Okay, Ooh. wow. Yeah, I was about to say that the, the, usually that's a true combo, but he, he kind of messed up the timing there and still got the cross slash uh, after the fair. Yeah, yeah. You see Carflow actually having to drift away with that down air right there because he knew that Dill was going to have enough time to run up with that dash attack and immediately get Cloud back in disadvantage. This ledge trap is important. That's where Dill, I feel like, really right happened right there. That is where Dill, I feel like, really shines compared to a lot of other Robs. She, like... She is so good at baiting her recovery. Like, knows how to just, like, you know, mash that stick up to be in just the right position, waiting to react to whatever move that you decide to whiff. This should be a tech. Oh, missed tech, actually. Yeah, that, that, I think that Ooh. move is that move actually is strong enough where it, it's, it's usually untackable. Great downer spike. Woo! And it, it kind of back in the game here. But, again, one fair or dash attack or detail from Rob sends Cloud where he doesn't want to be. Where, which is off stage. They just went from the middle of the he's stage to off stage, that. and he's dead for oh that. Oh my god! I told you, one dash attack. Everything Rob does puts you, puts Cloud in the exact scenario you don't want to be in. Which Look is why at this. Smashville was not the best stage for that matchup. You Robert, want more space. The robot didn't even have to move. Look at this. Because the, the picture here is that this was his only option to up B to not get hit by the gyro. Yeah. And then on the way down, there was still nothing he could do because there was not enough lag and Dill was able to get the forward smash out and then you died. I feel like his only option right there was to um, get the up B2 out. Like get like get yeah. like the falling hitbox there and grab the ledge for it. And hopefully that would still, that would probably would have beaten out the forward smash. Let's take a look at this again. He, nope, he, it's, it wasn't quick enough. Yeah. It wasn't quick enough. Great job by Dill up, up angling that uh, that forward smash upward like that to hit that angle. Because like when Cloud's coming down like that, it could be a little, it's a little fast. So I was impressed with the uh, reaction there. It's so um, rough, man. And like I said, they're gonna, he's gonna need more space. So going to PS2 is the right choice here. Um, let's just see. It's so rough, one. I, I honestly, so I think Carful showed a lot of like potential in that last game, I, I wouldn't be surprised if he could take this game against Dill. I wouldn't be surprised either. It's just so much harder for Cloud because like, even though Cloud's got a lot of good stuff in this matchup, your positioning against Rob is so important when you have a recovery that's as quote unquote ex as exploitable as Cloud's, you know? Some people always meme like, oh, just give him, <laughs> like that old like age old meme. Right. We all know that's just a meme. But with Rob though, look at this. It's the commitment. It's so the amount of commitment is so different with Rob yeah. compared to Cloud, and that commitment is just so much rougher on the end. When you got the projectile, you can spawn. When you can 
force Cloud to do a specific option to get around it and still have enough time to punish him afterwards. It's rough. You see even like the rising down airs and rising forward airs on the part of Carflow, even when they whiff, he's got to drift yeah. so far away to yeah. avoid getting hit by that Rob dash attack or the gyro, lest he get put right back at the ledge in that exact same position, my friend. This character Ooh, is good. I don't want yeah. to hear it. And Carflow missed an You're, opportunity you might there. Die for this. I mean, he had Dill forward aired his block. He had limit on deck. Could have done the up B out of shield and probably taken the stock, but... I guess he could probably maybe second guess the spacing because the spacing was a little tricky. Oh man, this is the really hard part getting off the ledge versus Rob. Kinda just, she kind of just let him roll. Yeah. Well, there you go. Definitely want to get back on stage right now. Fishing for the up smash. There you go. Definitely doesn't want to whip an up air right there. Just going to instead just wait to see wherever Rob is going to land. That's what I want to see more of from Carflow. We've never really seen Carflow really be able to get the chance because, you know, just getting Rob up in the air in the first place, you know, getting off the ledge is difficult enough. Once you get a hit on, you got it. Not even really necessarily focus on the true stuff. Just keep this character in Get the air as long stick. as you can. But it doesn't matter if you're playing the whole game off the level right here. Yeah, and a big thing is that... Oh, you're boy, dead. that you're is dead. a zero to you're death. You're dead, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead. You're you're dead. wrong you're dead. on that one, on that one. There was one opportunity there where he could have switched his DI to, so that he wouldn't die. He would still get hit, but he wasn't going to die. But he, he didn't DI properly one of those million moves in between. Like, right here... Uh, actually, honestly, I think I might be wrong about that. I think, I think that was just a G and a G. Carflow.exe has stopped working. Uh, armed robbery. And there's, right there. There it is. GG, man. Shake my hand. Shake my arm, Rotos. Yeah, that armed robbery, that side B, man. It's just, it's too broken. Well, it's too broken. Yeah, he needs to go into free fall after that move, Sakurai. Please, that move, that move is unbelievable. Honestly, honestly yeah, 